What is up everybody I'm back again with another video today's video is gonna be how to decrease your network latency and improve your internet speed for gaming on Windows 10. Basically I'm pretty sure everybody has seen a bunch of videos on this before but after this one you won't regret it. So let's get started to the video. So first of all you can see this icon here top right bottom just right click and open network internet settings go to internet or if you are on wireless just click on wireless then you will see on the right side change adapter options ethernet or wireless right click and click on properties search for internet protocol version 4 click on properties and apply this dns server address 1111 and alternate dns server 1001 and click on ok close now you can see my my pc icon here right click and click on manage Click on device manager, click on network adapters, on the first network adapter you will see the gigabyte ethernet controller, you have the different one, every one have the different one by their system specified. Click on on advanced so just take a break and leave it here and go to set a taskbar and right click and open task manager go to performance uh, as you guys can see I have four cores and four logical processors I have a low end PC so these settings are automatically applied for low end PC if you are on high end PC like uh, 8 cores and 16 logical processors and uh, 8 cores and 8 logical processor 4 cores and 8 logical processor so simple is that if you have more than more than 8 if you have 8 or more than 8 logical processor then I will show you how you can change these settings for high-end PC so let's get started so if you have the viewers in uh, anyone in between you have low end PC so select these settings as I have don't change it for these settings are for those who have high-end PC if you have low end PC just copy these settings as it is so first is energy efficient Ethernet disabled it for both high end and low end PC flow control for low end PC select RX and TX enabled for high end PC select it disabled and interpret moderation both both have enabled both select enable IPv4 disable both jumbo frame disable both large send disable both large send disable board large send disable both max IRQ per second so for high end PC have to click and type 9000 for low end PC you have to type 5000 like this and for next network address don't change it for both and see buffering for low end PC 512 for high end PC 1024 
1024 and receive scaling disable for low end pc and enable for high end pc shut down and wake up disable it for both if you have on lap uh, if you are on laptop then click on enable if you are on pc then disable for both low end and high end pc speed and deflex deflex auto navigation and negotiation if you want uh, if you have 10 mbps 10 mbps half and 100 mbps then select it but i'm going to go with auto negotiation tcp checksum rtx for low end pc and disable for high end pc rx same settings disable for high end pc low end for uh, low end pc for rx and tx enable buffers double for high end pc and 256 for low end pc udp checksum same disable for high end pc and rm tx for enable for low end pc and this is also the same for low end and high end pc for disable for high end pc lan id zero for both wake on magic packet enable for low end pc enable for high end pc wake on pattern match disable for low end pc and disable for high end pc so click on okay and close it move on to the next step internet boost internet right click and click on extract here so you can see boost internet folder here so right click and open it you guys can see these three applications uh, two applications and one registry file just click on right click and click on merge for registry file click yes and yes and the first one is tx rectx properties application just open it you can see this interface here click on edit list and add the game application or launcher where you want in which you want uh, better ping better connection i'm selecting epic game because i play fortnite a lot so open it and add it you can add multiple programs here click okay and make sure you have check these two boxes force warp and disable feature level upgrade you apply and okay the so move on to the final step where you upgrade your windows to the latest version by windows upgrade tool from microsoft run it i'm on latest version so the latest version of windows 10 right now is 20h2 from microsoft provided available in the market right now so to to check your windows version click right click on this please display and click on display settings on the left side bottom click on about you will see the version of your windows here under windows specification section 20h220 h2 is the latest version of windows 10 right now provided by the microsoft so you have to upgrade to the latest version of windows so all the bugs and fixes network errors will solved automatically if you are getting lot of packet loss and in this uh, internet connection errors this video will help you a lot so make sure to subscribe my channel and like the video i make a lot of content like this on fortnite gaming channel, gaming content and other stuff like that so make sure to subscribe my channel and like the video and comment down if you are having trouble with this video so see you in the next video
拜。